praise the Lord. Number one, in order for one kingdom to prevail over another, Numéro un, pour qu'un royaume puisse dominer sur l'autre, they must first capture and kill the king's heirs. Et il faut qu'il saisisse et qu'il détruise le roi du royaume, de l'autre royaume. Number two, they Numéro also deux. have to change the language of the king's sons. Il devait aussi changer le langage uh, du royaume du roi, c'est-à-dire du roi qu'ils ont vaincu. We must train people how to endure. Nous devons uh, former déjà et enseigner déjà comment uh, pe persévérer. Right. Now, in Daniel's day, when you saw the word meat in the, in the word, it meant the word of God. When you saw the word meat, it meant the word of God. Uh, vous savez, uh, quand vous écoutez uh, la douceur, c'est la parole de Dieu. All right. So they have to kill the heirs, then they have to change the language. Et la Kill the heirs, change the language. Kill the heirs, change the language. The L off of it, which meant suit for the Elohim. Vous savez, dans le cas de, de Daniel, ils ont changé leur nom et ils ont commencé par L. Et L signifie Elohim. So they refused to conform to the system. Ils ont refusé de se transformer, c'est-à-dire de s'adapter au système. So what did they do? They et put them in a furnace. Fait? They put them in a furnace. On les a mis dans le feu ardent. They heated it up seven times harder. Et le feu est fou. Rechauffé sept fois. They tried to kill the sons of God. Ils ont essayé d'exterminer les enfants de Dieu. They already had changed their names, but they didn't answer to those names. Ils ont changé leur nom, mais ils n'ont pas ajouté à leur nom. They tried to change their diet, their meat, but they wouldn't eat the king's meat. Ils ont décidé de changer leur nourriture, mais ils ont refusé de manger le repas du roi. And so it got them a trip to the fire. Alors cela les a emmenés dans le feu. Apostle preached last night. Le pasteur a prêché là hier. That God was getting us ready for the fire. Que Dieu nous prépare pour le feu. That they put them in the fiery furnace. Yeah. Et te met dans le feu, but they could not burn. Ils les ont mis dans le feu, mais ils n'étaient pas brûlés. Because the fourth man showed up. Parce que la, yeah. le homme présenté, and walked amongst the flames. Et il les a, um, and, and walked amongst the flames. Fire. He walked in the fire. He walked, okay. Then he les a fait marcher dans le feu. Not only did he walk through the fire, pas seulement qu'ils ont marché dans le feu, but he made it hot for the king, mais il l'a fait plus chaud au roi, and for his men, et pour ses agents, but cool for them. Mais pour ses siens, ça dit, ceux qui étaient dans le feu, c'était reconfort, merci. The only thing that the fire did for them, tout ce que le feu leur a fait, was to burn their bondage. de brûler leur corps. Leur lien, leur lien. Leur lien, leur lien. If you gain the wisdom of the spirit world where Jesus lives, you have the wisdom of all three. Si tu as la connaissance, la sagesse du monde dans lequel Jésus vit, tu as la sagesse sur tout. If you say to the fig tree, die, it's got to die. Si tu peux dire au figuier, meurs, Il mourra. If you say to the mountain, move, it's got to move. Si tu demandes à la montagne de sauter, elle sautera. If you say to your sin, obey me and leave me alone, it's got to go. Si tu dis à ton péché, quitte-moi, il doit te quitter. If you say to your bad circumstance, turn around, it's got to turn. Si tu demandes à tes mauvaises circonstances de changer, elle doit changer. Now if you say to your nation, get into God, it must obey. Et si tu ordonnes à ta nation, Dieu te récompense. Dieu te révélera des choses. 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 Dieu te révél
your voice. God will use your prayers. God will use your life. But you've got to obey God. Stand to your feet and pray. Just pray for just a moment. Just pray. This is the word of the Lord for this nation. I wish that I could tell you that Jesus was going to move in a certain way. And I wish I could tell you that he was going to defeat every enemy in your government. But he is not doing that, not yet. You have seats of wickedness all over the nation. Because the church does not understand that Jesus is calling for a revolution. Much bloodshed was caused by the hierarchy of this nation. Its royal families of the past and its governors of the past. There were treaties and agreements with Satan himself. And in that hour, the church fell asleep. But God is awakening the church. So he's not changing all of the circumstances. He is changing his people in This will be the church's finest hour. This will be the church's finest hour. Says the Spirit of the Lord. I will breathe power on you. And you will begin to change your home. Et vous allez commencer par transformer vos maisons. Change the churches. Transformer les églises. Change the people's hearts. Transformer le cœur des gens. And the people will rise up and govern. Et les gens vont se lever pour gouverner. In that hour. En ce temps-là. 
God will place upon a throne. Dieu mettra sur le trône the ministries of the apostle and the prophet. Les ministères des apôtres et des prophètes. They will be accepted. Ils seront reçus and enthroned. Et ils seront couronnés. And God will cause the people et Dieu to thank him for those gifts. The man who began this house Celui qui a commencé cette maison is being seated in apostolic office. A été établi, dans le ministère apostolique. That means you are now apostolic saints. Ce qui veut dire que vous êtes des saints apostoliques. Whatever grace falls upon him et chaque grâce qui tombe sur lui is supposed to fall on you. Doit tomber aussi sur vous. Whatever he is able to conquer et s'il arrive à conquérir you are supposed to conquer. Toi aussi tu dois conquérir. You have the flavor of the father. Tu as la flavor de l'ennemi. The father the papa that God set over this house. You will conquer like he conquers. You will rise as he rises. You are going to have better jobs. Better pay. Less sickness. Moins, ça dit, pas beaucoup de maladies. More energy. Plus d'énergie. Greater understanding. Grande compréhension. More comprehension of the word. Et une énorme compréhension de la parole. Than you have ever had. Que vous aviez eu. It is a new day. C'est un nouveau jour. Turn around three times. Tourne trois fois. Tourne toi trois fois. All things are passing away. Tout Everything's becoming brand new. You didn't land in the same place. You landed in a different place. God has shifted your lives. A change has come. You will not be the same. If you trust and believe God. If you were not here last night, si tu pas ici hier, you must get Apostle Charlotte's message. Tu dois, tu fais pour avoir le message d a, d a Charlotte. You must study it. Tu dois because my message came out of hers. Parce que tiré mon message de son message. If you can be here tomorrow morning, you must hear Apostle Pat finish. Et Pat va te 